Mobile phones work by using waves of electricity and magnetism called electromagnetism. Yeah, we thought they were two scientists, sciences, and then people found out, no, actually electricity makes magnetism, magnetism makes electricity. That's how electric motors work. Electromagnetism. Yeah, electric cars work because of electromagnetism. The magnetism making electricity and electricity making magnetism. In 1857, the man who invented the apparatus to send and receive R-E-C. There's a spelling mistake there. Receive. Sorry about that. Uh, send and receive. Is it I-E or V-E? I-E-I. Oh, I'm going to have to check that. Wireless electromagnetic signals was electromagnetic. Receive and send was born in 1857. His name was Rudolf Hertz. Oh yeah, every machine you've got says his name on the back. Well, it says HZ, which is short for Hertz. Hertz. Hertz thought electromagnetic wireless would never be useful. Yeah, it's the Wi-Fi you use in your home. Hertz is now the unit for frequency. Frequency. Yeah, 60 Hertz is what all electricity works on in your home. Everything you plug into the wall needs 60 hertz. And all over the world, everyone uses 60 hertz. After Mr. Rudolf Hertz. Electromagnetic waves are x-rays. Electromagnetic. X-rays, ultraviolet, light, infrared, microwaves, radio waves. Yeah, all the waves apart from sound waves and, and waves on the sea. Uh, and the waves that go up and down the wires in guitars. All of them are electromagnetic waves. Uh, we can see one of them. The rest of them we can't see, although snakes can see infrared. TV waves and wireless computer data waves called Wi-Fi. All thanks to Mr. Hertz.